Hello and welcome back to Let's Play Quake 2 Juggernaut. We are in the living quarters. Abandoned living areas show little evidence of the people who lived here. Passageways are littered with unwanted items too heavy to carry. Okay, so let's continue on our quest through the bizarre world of Quake 2 Juggernaut, which claims to be the new story. That's what it says, Quake 2 Juggernaut, the new story. It's certainly a different story. Well, as, as different as an FPS can be, of this kind anyway. But it appears that the straw are allied with these bizarre creatures. Of course, the truth of the matter is, they're just reskinned enemies. Enforcers or straw grunts. Um, I have no idea what the monkeys are. Oh, super shotgun. That looks like Jupiter out there, because we're on, I think, I believe it's Europa. It's just okay. Yeah. okay, well let's just continue then. There are a lot of these minor enemies here. Which are dead easy to just shoot you with. Some of them have machine guns. The problem with this game is it doesn't give you direct objectives, it just gives you some information about the area. Because the reality is there's not really much to do in each of these areas. Except just to shoot you with them. I thought that was a button to push there. This looks like some sort of either a lab or a canteen. Is that supposed to be a sink with sludgy water in it, perhaps? Anyway, it looks like these are things you can interact with, but it's not. More chubby cheers. Oh, it looks like I was stuck in the door for a second. Is there anything in here, or is this just a dead end? I'll leave that health for later, should I need it. Well, there's a part along here that we still need to look through. Actually, are one of those Icarus characters, Icari, as it were, are still about. I can hear them, but I can't see them. How many enemies are there? 77. We have killed 27. 28 now. But yeah, everyone here is relatively easy to kill. So look at that, that was the Enforcer's um, chain gun death animation, red key. But since the model isn't as uh, detailed as that, it just it looks like it was coming out of his stomach to fire. These characters look very certainly love crafting actually. They've got like tentacles coming out of their mouths, like Cthulhu. How bizarre. Well, it looks like we're running out of ammo for that, so it should maybe Oh no bullets for the machine gun. Plenty of rockets there. These guys can just die from that. Except that very often sends him into a ducking animation, which is annoying. Look at him wiggling there in his death throws. Oh, oh that was sore. Got him there. Let's pick up all this health. This room is an identical copy to the other room. Copy and paste job. Um, and there's nothing important. You can't open that fridge. No, I can't. Okay. Well, we're looking for the red key, so it must be further down here then. At least they're giving us shotgun ammo. Because shotgun ammo is probably the best thing to use against these guys. Ow. I didn't notice him down there. I think I'll go back and get some health. There was one somewhere down here, wasn't there? In here? Hmm, maybe not. Maybe I took it. Oh, here it is. It's in the kitchen. And some grenades.
Nice. Oh, shit. Ooh. Looks like he jumped straight over there. Yep. He's dead. You need something that packs a punch against those guys. And this can just use. This can be used to clear out. Well, maybe one at a time, but that's perhaps a bit wasteful. Well, here's some jacket armor. Combat armor, rather. And some more grenades. These are weird looking chairs. Ah, there's a red key. Rockets. Maybe I'll save it here then. Save. Living quarters. Yeah, I wish there was some variety in each of these rooms. Anyway, let's continue. More chain gun ammo or mini gun ammo. Ah, and there's a mini gun there. These weapons are probably the most useful because. Despite the fact that the shotgun is effective at taking down those guys, because there's so many of them, it's actually easier just to mow them down with the machine gun. There we go. Ah, look at those guys. Oh, look at this. That's quite detailed. Ah, there's an echo still. I think a rocket launcher would be good in this occasion. Get rid of the gun out. Ah, you can't get that. There's that. That looks like a lift. There's another one. That one looks more healthy. The other one looks like there's a bit of missing from it. Okay, let's get rid of him. And pick up the ammo and armor. This is quite an interesting looking room though. I mean, they put some effort into this room's detail. That's the thing about this game, it's very difficult to judge because it's so varied. Sometimes it's actually pretty good, other times it's terrible. The question is, is it better when you play it later, or is it better when it was originally about and I'm stuck in the ladder? That's not good. There we go. Like, I think a lot of people were probably expecting a lot more from this game when they played Quake 2 back in the day, and particularly with the other expansion packs around at the time. Um, the two official ones, um, Ground Zero and The Reckoning, were actually very well received. This one off the back of those two, not so much. So I guess people were disappointed at the time. Um, I certainly was. But it's still a good blast for some mindless entertainment, I guess. Okay, so what do we need to do here then? Do we need to shoot something or can we get across there maybe? Yes, we can. This looks like a broken part of a bridge. And then, ah, that looks interesting. Is that shootable? Ah, look! It's... Oh, it's part of a... a hollow bridge? By the looks of things. Hmm, well anyway. Let's go in here. And we're on to the next level. Okay, so... What level is this? Let me just kill these guys and then we'll find out. The Rec Deck. It was here that our ancestors would enjoy limited recreation in Europa. This access is the lab area. The lab contains the memory core and PCD, whatever that stands for. All very similar looking corridors. Lots of ammo. Hmm, huh. okay. Well, let's save. 
I guess, well no, we can't get through there, so we have to go that way. I was going to say, I guess they all, those two parts lead up to the same area, but we can only go this way, so let's do that. It's annoying when they all make the same noise when they die, more or less. Hmm. The hyperblaster, they haven't edited the, the picture of the pickup in the, the items HUD. But anyway, never mind. Um, that was where we came from, wasn't it? That must be part of that block off corridor. And stick with the machine gun for a moment. Um, I've got plenty of ammo for that. Well, that was where that blocked off corridor was. Kill some more mutated enforcers. If that's what we call Oh, he had a last gas. Let's mow these guys down. And pick up the chain but not use it. And he's down. So is our ladders? Yes, here they are. Hmm. Oh, perfect. Just what I needed. The salmon. Hmm. Is that a secret area up there? Could be. If I can get to it. Oh, maybe I need to jump across. It just looks like an area that you can crouch into. Oh, it's quite difficult to get to. Though. I'll try it once more. See what happens. Jump. Hmm. Maybe jump and crouch. That might work. Yeah. Now, is it anything? Let's get this out to find out. No, it wasn't a secret area. Oh well. Hmm. What is this? Some sort of stadium? It is a recreation area after all. Oh, that wasn't really what I wanted to see, but never mind. I wanted this for some long distance killing. Yeah. Missed them. I've got them that time. Right here. Oh, I hear a gunner. Two guns. And some Nicholas. Can I get in there? Ah, oh, blue key. It's basically just a, you know, find the key, get to the next part of the level, complete the level. Oh, it's a swimming pool, because there's a diving board. That explains it. But yeah, I wish they would put more interactivity in it. No, these guys just came in. As you're going to call. Oh, there's a mutant there. That's not good. I'm trapped. Okay, too many enemies. Time to switch for something more powerful. Okay, do I have any ammo for that gun? It just was put away. Okay, this isn't good. I'm in trouble. There we go. Oh, yeah, I had plenty of ammo for that gun. It looked like when I got it out, it just disappeared. Oh, well, there's health back here. So we're looking for the blue key. I presume that was the door we came in. Oh no, there is the blue key, perfect. Is that a door? No. Hmm. I wonder if this is poisonous. Lifeguard on duty. No, there isn't. Unless I'm the lifeguard. Yeah, that looks kind of dangerous to go in there. 
I mean, you can get out of the game. There is health in there. Did I risk it? Yeah. There's a dead guy though. And what is that? A rubber ring? Yeah, it's supposed to be some life thing. Oh well. Right, let's get out and use the, the blue key. I think it was this door here. Yeah. And a monkey. What's the point in this? Can I shoot that out or something? No. Yeah, that was bizarre. So that wasn't for anything then. Hmm. Okay. Unless there's another door that has the blue key. I just don't understand why there'd be a door with the blue key and nothing in it. Can I climb up here? Yes I can. Whee! Okay, uh, let's go in that long corridor then. That was in before. That was this way. And use this gun for a while. How many enemies have I killed? Oh, 104. Still lots to go. And this is the part that I was trapped at. Ah, here's some enemies. The only thing is I don't have armor now, so everything that I take as a hit is going to be for my health. Hmm. Maybe a rocket launcher would do? Them out with shotguns. Yeah. There was a gunner up there, that's not good. Oh, rockets. Not good. Take cover under here, that's a problem. Hey, they're fighting each other. They were fighting each other. But they're everywhere. They're up there, aren't they, the gunners? Hmm. Are they dead? Looks like they are. And plenty of doors to go through. Yeah, the death animations are not great. Anyway, we're up on this top part now. And more fans. Ah, there's those guys there. So I think I need to get across there. Oh, is that a key card? Oh, well, there's a gladiator there, that's not good. Yeah, I don't want to get hit by him. Yes, red key. So, where's the red key door then? What was on this side? Oh, that must be the... It's a symmetrical room. This must be the stairs. Oh no. That's the red key door there. Well, you can... Oh, okay, there's a medic, that's not good. As the evil gripped Callisto, our ancestors tried desperately to find a cure. They tested on animals, but with no success. Ah, the monkeys. Eons later, the offspring of these creatures still prowl the complex. And the flyers. Hmm, some interesting history on the enemies of this game. Apparently they were working on some kind of cure for Godnum's Swat, and it didn't go well. 
Anyway, this is the labs. So join me in part five of Let's Play Quake 2 Juggernaut to explore those. This is Lizard Jeans signing out.